Hello me, Empire everybody, this is Rampain, and welcome back to my Cyrodiilic Empire campaign, where we are going to continue where we left off from last time. We've had an interesting turn of events recently, where Skyrim, one of my closest allies, has betrayed me. And now, we're not in the best of positions with them. Um, my western provinces are in extreme danger. I don't like that you guys are actually able to march through here. I guess they can actually walk through this area. I should have put a fort there and tried to hold them off, but wasn't able to. So, my hope is to hold Skingrad and to hold Korhal. Those are my two most important settlements out here that I'm going to have to try and defend. Um, Anvil's probably another one that will try and defend. I'm not letting myself recruit those. Um, let's start recruiting just anything we can from, like, Kavach, Skingrad. I need to get a military presence up here so we can start trying to defend these settlements. Um, I'm going to take the Emperor and uh, Mena Monaco. I'm just going to send them up through Hilalu's lands. For the Emperor. I wish I could buy this from you guys. But Soldiers win wars. your guys are going to be pissed off at some point anyways. It's only... It's how far down does my thing go? So, let me actually just... These grave times so it's literally one day extra day turn all time to get you there. Yeah. Because we want you to head up towards Fort Dongard. Because the they're, they're going to be pissed. I know they are. I'm gonna hope they stay away. I don't. I just don't have time to deal with them. I don't. Um, I'll keep a good, decent garrisons here to defend these cities, but I'm not gonna try and deal with them. We just need to march and on the uh, Skyrim forces as quickly as possible. Yep. 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 <laughs> That's just gonna piss them off. Oh God! Why'd you have to go that way? It's, ah, fuck. Okay. Well, that's gonna be your mate. Yeah, I was kind of expecting this, though. Okay. First thing I'm going to do, probably, is I'm going to attack this settlement because I want to solidify what I've got up here. Um, we're going to continue pushing slowly but surely into Vardenfell. I'm not going to bring a huge amount of forces down here. Joffrey and the Dawnguard, they can handle that. Still retraining the forces here. Um, I can get some catapults. Um, and I think what I might try and do is it's been suggested that maybe I try and... I want to actually take these lands. I don't want to do what I'm doing in my Stormcloak campaign right now where I am going a Viking. I'm raiding, destroying, and then leaving. No. If I'm taking land from Skyrim, I am holding that land. I'm going to push them out. So as they're trying to attack me on my western flank, I'm attacking them on their eastern flank. Hopefully we get a more favorable trade out of that, especially since I'm bringing three pretty major armies up there. Um, do you guys have... You, you have A-Ram. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait till I have a little bit more for that. I feel like you guys just won't be all that happy if I only send that. Um, but no, let's go with Joffrey. You... Let's just do one army at a time. Yeah. One army at a time. I'm going to... Well... I'm going to be careful with how much we're fighting, so I will actually uh, do a night battle, only fight the 4,000. Fighting 5,000, it's not technically too much different um, of a difference in the number of forces, but let's do this so that we can just focus on this one army with Joffrey's ar uh, forces. Get down to the front line. Because I know my guys are better quality, and they'll be able to do a lot of damage, and we should win this battle. We're not gonna. We shouldn't lose too many of our men as long as we're careful with placement. Because I didn't see any mages. I just saw a bunch of infantry. Um, that's all I saw. And I do have some cavalry, so we can try and make use of that. Um, just start the battle. I do have a decent amount of mages and archers. Turn on skirmish mode and fire arrows. And I think I am actually gonna leave you guys kind of as you are for now. I'm expecting the AI to advance forward on me, and I've got a lot of cavalry. Let's have them kind of sitting over here. Infantry, you're kind of fine. There we go. Because I want to take advantage of my ranged units as much as possible. I want to double check I didn't see any mages. I'm pretty sure I didn't see any mages. Mm. 
No, I did not. Okay, I shouldn't have to worry too much about that. Just wait on you guys to get in range. Okay, now we're opening fire. Definitely want to take out the the heavy ash spawn, oh, the ash spawn heavy swordsman. Those guys and the corpus lame. They're probably the most important units for me to use a lot of my uh, ranged units on. Dangoth, Spearman, and Swordsman as well. Because those units are actually pretty good. Um, or they're more comparable to what I've got. Yeah, let's start advancing forward here. Really, we've only killed 1% of them so far? Jesus. Okay, two. Now we've killed 80 guys. Thank you. I may just open up fire too soon. I want to get as much out of you guys as we can. Here comes all. Okay. Infantry. Let's have you guys run forward. And cavalry. I want you guys to kind of line up here. Definitely going to want to make some use of my forces to try and flank them. Oh, didn't mean to pause it. to move my skirmishers back. Back up a little bit, guys. Mages, too. Joffrey, head over here. There's a hole right there. I want you to fill it. Skirmishers, get in position, and then start opening fire again. Um, shit. Attention to you guys. Back off. Well, you actually go right here. You can turn over here. Let's try and surround this unit and then charge them properly. There we go. Go for the Ash Zombies now. 13% of their forces have died already. Come on, please kill them a little faster. Yeah, because we need to really help out this spot right here. Joffrey keeps spamming that and get an actual melee combat. You're kind of just casually fighting. You guys are not fighting. I'm gonna... You're gonna be attacked soon. <laughs> just stay where you are. 22 to 3. You finish these guys off a little faster. Yeah, I can't fight you guys next time. Gonna really work out well. Just charge this unit. We need to start uh, cycle charging into the enemy forces. Our cavalry charges do a lot of damage to the Dagon forces. Like, let's see, they're at 151 right now. They lost 50 guys in that charge. And charge back to this unit. There's not many of them. Just keep cycle charging back and forth. Joffrey keeps spamming the rally ability. Okay, pull back. Pull back. I said pull back! These guys are coming in to charge them too. Alright, what are you guys doing on morale? Wounded Eager. They're doing well. They even started trying to flank me, have they? No. They haven't even brought in all their men. Thankfully, that's nice. My archers are actually getting a lot of work out over there. Okay. Let's keep trying to clear this flank right here with my cavalry. Uh, but once they've committed, you guys are slowly moving up. Because the dreamers are really slow. So I'll let my archers focus fire them down as much as I can. And then I'll get you guys in here. Because right now I'm letting you kind of just hold your position. You guys are not doing so hot. Up again. 50% of their forces are already dead. So they've already lost 2,000 men. Okay, you line up right here. We're going to have you charge in a second. They're kind of going more towards my center. And if you guys can... No, I'll just keep choosing your own targets. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Come over here. Move a little bit, and then 
properly charge the dreamers, just for more sides. God, they're so slow. 62% of their forces are already dead. Okay, that's good enough on that charge. Pull back again. Yeah, so that's going to be one thing that's nice, because that's... I don't remember that from when I was playing Dagon. The Dreamers are so slow that I can focus on the forces they send at me first, and then the Dreamers kind of come in. They're kind of a reinforcing army, um, or the fresh troops, because they're so slow, but it also lets me just destroy them um, with my archers, because they just take so long to get to me. Like, I'm curious how many kills my archers got, honestly. Oh, that's, who's that? That's the day of the bodyguard. Ignore him. He's a worthless unit that I don't care about, honestly. He's just inconsequential for my plans overall. But no, this area is going to really fall with all my infantry that I've got over here. We've only lost 10% of my forces, honestly. Which is pretty damn good. Cavalry, keep backing off. This flank really needs help. Joffrey's doing a good job holding this section. You guys... Maybe you want to redirect your attention? Just maybe over here. Those areas aren't doing so hot. These guys are doing fine. Keep... God, these dreamers take forever to kill. And back off again. I like this cab unit so much more than the other one that I have. It's actually decent. Get some more charge over here. So they've now lost 85% or 87% of the forces. It just sucks that with Dagoth, we have to kill everything. We just have to kill everything. It's going to be a slog to get there. But we've won this. Right, you guys have almost entirely destroyed this force over here. My mages are focused firing these guys now. Oh, yeah, we're almost done. But this is pretty much done for. Also, you guys are running the campaign now. Nothing really. Not much left, really. There's 6% of their forces. We just have to kill the rest. Great there we go. Wow, we only lost 300 guys. Yeah, how many kills do my archers get? My archers. Two, 300 kills each. Blades got about 300 kills, yep. How much did my mages get? Mages didn't get many kills. Cavalry did pretty decent too, but my archers and my cohorts did the most damage for sure. About 300 per. Okay. Okay, so now there should be very few source forces. Well, there's actually still the one army near Caldera. Let's see. How many guys are here to fight? You also have night battle. Yeah, no, let's do this again. You guys, again, no... Oh, you guys do have mages. Um, okay. But this army is not nearly as well put together as I would like in comparison to my army that is being led by Joffrey. Um, but yeah, no, let's rush in here with you as well. This should pretty much open up Caldera for us to easily slaughter them all. And then we can go from Caldera and start pushing on the Ghost Gate with you guys. Um, I'm going to try and go through this battle a little bit faster as the other one took a, eh, a little bit of time to do. Uh, these battles against Dagoth are just a huge slog. They're always going to be a slog because they have no morale. or They have unlimited morale, I mean. Um, so I'm always going to have to just slaughter them all. Because this one I have to worry about their mages. Uh, I don't like that position. I really don't like this positioning. Okay. Let me get my arch, archers first, crossbowmen together too. Uh, turn off skirmish mode. Fire arrows off. You guys kind of be behind the crossbowmen. And we'll let them open fire initially. Um, I have two cav units, and they're not the best. I have a lot of infantry. That's the thing that this army's really got a lot of, is infantry. I'm trying to have my cavalry here. Yeah, you guys just kind of stay as you are. I'll adjust you as they get closer. Oh, they're kind of in a position where I can actually focus on them. Two 
encourage you guys to try and run forward. If we can. So I kind of like this hill and how they're positioned right now. So let's have you guys kind of move forward. Rush into position. You guys... Let's move you too. You guys as well. Right there. And then cavalry. Kind of, well... Yeah, still, oh, no, actually go on my other side. Go on the left flank. If I can move you there. There we go. Now you guys go in this manner. They're, are they trying to go up the hill? Okay, well, let me get my guys in position first. Okay, some of my guys are just about actually in position, so I'm just going to start kind of charging into them. Got a lot of those corpus stalkers right here. This is going to be a huge melee fight, so let's get my guys in position. Yeah, there's a lot more of you guys over here than I would like. Um, let's actually bring you guys over on this side. Prefer to run down hill than favor. uphill. If we remain true uh, and crosswomen will move be a ours. little bit. Archers are fine. Just move the crosswomen a little. And everybody else is still getting in position, right? Where are you guys? Get in there and help. Only one for so far. Okay, Cavalry, I need you up here so we can start charging these guys. They actually feel like they're winning right now, which I don't like. Try and run up here and give these guys some support. Get Cavalry one right here. Because how are your stats? You're kind of comparable. You guys are kind of mediocre. Very mediocre units. Okay, kind of just hold here again. I don't know, we'll let them march up the hill, tire themselves out. It's not going to specifically help them route, but it will help try and tire them out. And their combat effectiveness, if I remember correctly, does decrease, actually. Um, Our men are winning the battle. If we does decrease like this, with them being uh, more tired. There we go. Let's take out the heavy swordsman. He is doing well. Let's get go back out again. Let's get another charge. Okay, actually, you guys are holding more this way? Yeah. It's a little bit better of an area to charge to. How are we doing numbers so far? 8 to 14. We're losing a bit more men. The uh, units in this army are not nearly as well prepared um, as Joffrey's forces. So he's definitely more of a support army. And a lot of my Dawn Guard are dead. But where are those mages? You guys. Focus the ass. Focus the ass, slaves, please. I do not like them shoot. Looks like they're actually hitting some of their own men, honestly. But no, my cavalry are almost done here with these guys. Then I can bring these guys around and flank this area. Let's get 11, 23. Just a tiny bit. Is she killing the Ashlades? Yeah, you're slowly killing them all. It's taking a while, but you, it's, it's working. Come on, finish off these fuckers! They keep spamming that ability. Oof. Oh, now they're kind of hitting some of you. Not doing a lot of damage, actually. Man, you guys are taking those like champs. Eh. Okay, so they've got about half that unit left. Come on, how many more are there left? 35? I almost want to bring you guys back. Pull back. I'm still trying to play you guys flank around now. Start trying to charge this area. Or actually kind of more back here. Oh, come on. Fuck this hill. Okay, one of you. And then the other. God, that hill's annoying. Where are we at now? We are now at 37 to 17. Not bad, not bad. This is a bit of a melee slog, though. I'm going to start trying to kind of 
pull in and start surrounding these guys. I'll give you guys a little bit more update as things continue. Um, I think if things are going well in this battle, and we should be fine because this is like what? The battle is very much in our favor. If we... Although I do want to show this charge. Us charging this area. Wow, that's a horrible charge. Come on, guys. I was trying to give you the spotlight here. Okay, I'll give these guys. Start moving these guys in. And I'll start getting to this melee slog. You guys keep charging there. And do I want to bring you on? Nah, just keep helping. Keep supporting. You're supposed to help out too. Cavalry go over here. Oh, back off, actually. We're just going to have to continue this melee slog for a, bit, a little bit. So I'll come back to you guys in a bit. So overall, things are going fairly well right here. You guys are doing pretty well on this flank. Although, actually, one of you kind of come over and help out over here. These Dagoth Swordsmen and Dreamers are kind of doing a decent amount of da damage to us, actually. So I'm going to bring one of you over on this side. I'm going to... I kind of want my general to actually start trying to help out over here. It's kind of dangerous. It is. But it's kind of worth the effort. And honestly, I think I might even grab my archers and bring them over here. They have no ammo. So we kind of bring them over as extra reserves to just flank the enemy. Um, you guys are winning. I'm losing like half third of my army. Come on, guys. You need to keep fighting. Keep spamming the rally ability, and then you guys kind of just flank and help out. Because your smelly stats... Oh, yeah, they're, they're, they're better. So, yeah, I'll, it'll still help to have you guys in the way. I still need to actually properly get you guys and uh, retrain you. I still need to find a good place to retrain you at. You, Caldera actually might have a good fighter's guild. Or maybe I just have to bring them to Ebonheart. So I don't want to lose you Our guys. Are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Because they've only got 20% of their forces left. Our army is tiring. So my guys are tiring, which is sucking. Because I was hoping these guys would be able to finish up quickly and then help out this spot. But that does not seem to be the case. Bring my archers over, though, is something for sure. So I'm going to keep them fighting for a little bit longer. It's still going to be more of a melee slog, but things are going well. I, we should still be fine. Especially how many of this Dago Swords been left. Oh, my God. Okay. They're practically dead over here. So now I can take all of you guys and bring them over to the last few men that are left. Well, actually, come on, guys. How many are left over here? There you go. Okay. Let's get the last unit. My entire army just focused this streamer down. There's only 50 of them. And, oh, my God. I last almost half my army. That is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous that we lost almost half my army for this. Then again, my infantry is not the best for this army. I still saw my light legionnaires, I got some bandits. Like not, not many of these guys are all that great. Archers are doing pretty good for themselves. I'm honestly expecting they got most of the kills. By the victory Oof, we have won here guys. today. Yeah, like my crossbowmen got like 200-ish kills on average. Archer, eh, my archers actually didn't too much. The crossbowmen did a lot more damage. Oh, you guys, yeah, got a lot of kills too, actually. Never mind, my infantry did their job. <laughs> they did it fairly efficiently. It's just, well, not efficiently, effectively. Um, well, I just lost a decent amount of them, honestly, for that. But this is why I need to try and retrain the army the Dawn Guards got. Um, I wonder how much damage we're actually doing to Dagoth's military. I know they can usually feel a lot of guys pretty easily. Now. Okay, well, we'll take Caldera next turn. Don't retrain them. My instinct is to... I mean, not don't retrain them. Don't merge them. My first instinct is to try and merge them together, but I can't. Yeah, because if I could grow this city, I could get a fighter's... Get a larger enough fighter's kill here. This is going to take a while. Okay. Because this is going to be a good settlement for sure to reinforce us. Okay, one thing I'm going to do before I end this turn. Um... Get as many troops as I can. 
Because you're already recruiting, I just need to make sure anybody that can, that's close by, is recruiting some units. I don't care what they are. Get some units, get them ready, and send them forward. Because I need to I need to repel the Skyrim forces as much as I can. And we need to buy time. Really need to buy time. I wish you guys were free upkeep. Are you not free upkeep here? I think the Fighters Guild are. So grab them instead, because I'm going to get rid of this guy. It's 300 and 130 there. I don't want to have those guys taking up extra slots. Um, honestly, I'm trying to save a lot of my money for forces and not building stuff. Better farm. Maybe the Ballista Towers. Shaden Hall. Get the City Hall. Please do ignore me here, Hilalu. I do not want to fight you. I do Empire's not want to fight you. Man. Yes, my lord. Soldiers win Just give me some time. Where Just walk my forces see? through. We'll be what gone and out of your hair Glory in no Empire. time at all. What is it? Ah, yeah, the Emperor. Why are you going that way? You need to go this way, Emperor. The the okay, but let's end this turn. You guys, I still need to actually put you in more force. Um, especially because you're a mage. Soldiers win wars. Where to put the keys? The key. Uh, just stand there for now. Keep trying to recruit more guys to put in these forts. I need to just be more careful on how I'm moving them. You should have been fine to walk around, but the law. you know you're Texas. stupid. Okay, end the turn. You prefer, okay, take my I am going to be. These guys are so fucked, but I'm gonna try and fight all these battles. I don't want to just roll over and die for Skyrim. I am going to give them a fight. It's. I'm sorry we haven't actually done too much this video, at least in terms of how much time has progressed on the campaign map. But I feel like I need to fight some of these battles. I feel like I would have taken a lot more casualties if I would have uh, just auto-resolved the battles with I'll Joffrey and such. The upper hand in this I like this sport. I like this sport. Might really get a decent amount of kills from this. That's weird. Um, we do not have. Can you please burn the ram? Can you burn the ram for me? I don't expect to, but we'll see. Oh, they also have ladders too. Shit. You actually just pull back to the city center. There's no need our to try and fight by the gates. The enemy siege tower has reached our walls. Yeah, just go back to the Let city center. and skill at arms lead Because I need you guys to have unlimited morale. The Lord, the enemy are battering down the gates. Get as many kills as we can off of the towers. That's all I'm hoping for. To arms, my lord. The enemy's ram has breached the gates. And you're getting slaughtered. Saint George, save us. The enemy have the wall. Only intervention by the Almighty or a military genius can bring us victory from this. Killed 6% of the forces. Can we get up to maybe 15? I'll be happy if we kill 15% of their forces. Maybe 10. I just, I'm not expecting Our much from you guys. Yeah, there goes my if general. Battle while his soldiers still fight. May his infamy follow him. Yeah, this is why I brought you guys back to the city center. You guys almost back? Half our force remains. Oh, come on. <laughs> If you guys were going to run, why didn't you just run along the tower, the walls? We must secure his release. Well, we got at least 10% of their forces killed. Long and are becoming tired. Yeah, I'm going to have to reclaim this settlement our enemy has command of the castle. Well, I'm proud of you, town guardsmen. You, you tried. You tried to defend the empire. <sighs> some damage. Not much, but it's some damage. Oh god, this is not gonna be fun. My western flanks can get fucked on. Uh, I wish I would have known that one other pass because my fort placement's been working well. The fort placement I set up initially for the crowned and red guard, it was um, it was it was well placed except for the one I missed. So there's Sanka Torgon. Tomorrow's journey Fort planned Gidditch. out, sire. Those I don't mind. Citizens, 
Go home and lock this is going to be another quick one, but I'm going to try and hold them back. If we can kill another 10% of their forces, I will be happy. We're just going to pull back to the um, to the city center. Actually, I'm going to leave one of them kind of by the gate. I want the towers active. Well, no, this is a fort. Never mind. It shouldn't, well, it shouldn't have towers. Does it have towers? If it, have t if it has towers, I'm leaving one guy kind of close to the gates so they're active. No towers. Never mind. Just guard the city center, because that's all you guys can hope to accomplish. That's literally all you guys can hope to accomplish, is just sit here. There. Sit here, be in guard mode, and then I'm just gonna spam the rally ability. The enemy what the are battering fuck? down the gates! I only just noticed how my fort is fucking floating. How did I not? What the hell? To arms, my lord! The enemy's ram has breached the gate. Okay. Um, I don't see why you guys needed the ram, but. Saint George, save us! The enemy okay. have the walls. Look to our defense, or all will be. This lost. is gonna be quick. But if you guys can again get 10% of their forces killed, I will be happy and I'll be proud. Reform, you spineless women! Pray something changes in the course of battle, for defeat seems almost certain. They're slaughtering me right now. Reform, you spineless women! They're not dying too quickly. That's good. That's good. You guys are complete pushovers. St. George, protect us! Oh, generals are Our dead. general lies slain upon the battlefield. But this is why we're just sitting in the city center. Come on, 3% of the forces are dead. Come on, can we get to 10? I'll be happy if we get to 10. Because these are shite units. You guys are actually giving them hell. You're taking forever to die. Well, there goes pretty much all my forces. We killed 6%. It's not too bad. There was a larger force. I guess I can't hope to get 10%. We almost killed the same amount of guys, but you guys tried. If I would have had better forces prepared in that fort, I think it would have done a little bit better. But, nope. My main hope is going to be Core Hall and Skingrad. Uh, those are the main settlements I need to hold. If I lose some of my forts, okay, that's fine. They don't do a lot hold for me. Core Hall and all my other settlements, though much, much more important that I can hold those and then use those as a point to fight back against Skyrim. Well, if anything, not really even. Technically, yeah, I'll want to push back from these areas, push back into uh, my western flank, but it's more important right now that we're holding them at bay and giving the Emperor and his forces time to get in position and start attacking the eastern flank of Skyrim. Because if we can do that without much damage uh, taken, we can we can do this. Like, oh, you fancy uncle? Oh, fuck me. Has I got my mages up here, though. I got my mages. Um, I have one more turn to recruit some guys. I have one archer, two mages. Okay, yeah, get one of these. Because that'll be a decent garrison for Core Hall. Um, These grave you get any mercenaries? Each legionnaire must be his better self at all times and under all no. conditions. It wasn't long before I saw my <sighs> sit in the fort for now. Soldiers, keep sending wounds. these guys over here. Poor dear, just fucked. You guys so just recruit who you can. I'd rather have you recruit. Oh, not. I'm, I'm not letting my recruit the, myself recruit Akavir down here. Technically, that's the best option is to recruit them, but I'm not going to do that for myself. Okay, Kavach and Anvil. I'm going to try and garrison you guys up to keep recruiting some of the Fighters Guild. Can you give them mages? No, I'll just do that. Using to hold them back bay as long as I can. Indurum Dank Arthur. Okay, that's fine by me. Wairus doesn't like me. Why does Wairus not like me? Okay, you'll be out of their hair in a second. They already hate me as much as they really can. Um, okay, keep moving this way, Emperor. I do not want you walk because otherwise you get stuck here. Keep moving up here. You guys, I'm honestly. And these guys, and this should be 
Oh, that's easy to resolve. Just a breakthrough, take Fort Dawn Guard. So we've taken a settlement, and they've taken a settlement. So at the moment, we're equal. Can't really recruit anything here, that's fine. But it's now a section that we can rush into. So, actually, what is it? What do they have in Riften? I don't know, not all of you can go there. These grave times, each legionnaire must be his So everybody but you can get to Riften. You can see Gene Riften then. The city. Meet the soldiers gathering for the attack. Wanna push as quickly as we can. Oh, they're just a bunch of mages. This might actually do really well in the auto resolve for me. If not, then I'll just keep sending more men over. Um, how are the Akaviri doing on their training? Ah, oh, you guys are going to take so long. Bare minimum. I need about five turns. At least five turns to get you guys in position. And then I can bring you guys down. I'm going to definitely take you in the fleet. I'm probably going to actually have you guys like strike uh, Winterhold, actually. By the time you guys are ready, Metamarco and the Emperor should be close by. <sighs> Any more archers for you guys? I'm, I'm still worried about them attacking these settlements. At least I have the Ballista, but... I still worried. Oh, I forgot you were attacking Pale Pass Ruins, too. Fuck. Keep greeting the Fighters Guild, too. Okay. Let's end this turn. Do one more end turn. We're getting out of now. I'm going to start with attacking them here. Or defending here. I could actually win this. Maybe. We'll have to see. But I'm going to come back to this video and fight this in the next video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys did, maybe like, comment, and or subscribe. If you guys did not, please let me know why so I can try and improve. Also check out my Discord. It's a great way to interact with the rest of my community and get updates on videos. Additionally, there are other ways to continue to support my channel in the description, so you can check that out. This is Rampant, and I'll see you guys next time.